Brazil contains more than half of South America's Amazon rainforest, and government officials there are reporting a huge jump in wildfires, up 84 percent compared to a year ago. That's put deforestation into the international spotlight, along with Brazil's populist president, Jair Bolsonaro. Thursday, without providing evidence, he accused some non-governmental groups of setting fires in the rainforest in retaliation for losing state funds under his administration. He also lashed out at journalists. Bolsonaro has described Brazil's rainforest protections as an obstacle to economic development. He says he wants to convert land for cattle pastures and soybean farms. Thursday, the spokesman for the UN's Secretary General weighed in. We're very concerned uh, about these fires, both, I think, for the immediate damage uh, that they're causing, and also because sustaining forests is crucial in our fight uh, against climate change. NASA gauges the scope of the problem through its satellite imagery. And the fires we're seeing today have all of the hallmark characteristics of deforestation fires. They're being set at the interface between standing Amazon forests and the edge of existing agricultural areas. They're being set at a time of year when the rest of the landscape isn't particularly vulnerable to wildfires. So the human actions that are going into setting these fires are very intentional. Amnesty International is pinning blame for the wildfires on Bolsonaro, while Germany and Norway have decided to withhold millions in funding for sustainability projects in Brazil's forests. Experts say Brazilians, especially farmers, could be the first victims of excessive deforestation, with higher temperatures leading to less rain and changes in the climate. Ned Barker, Associated Press.